attending to um, download and test the transactions. S80 have been um, out of life for two two years now, so the uh, software and the apps on the pack stores is old. Sometimes on the terminals, um, this is all used terminal that uh, need to be reset. They delete everything from the terminal, so there's nothing on it. Because of that, um, I will have to perform some uh, firmware update. For to work so right now this thing is not working i have to hold this do this when the logo come in press cancel a couple of times i'm gonna do remote download number three new download tcp Okay, I need to bring up the uh, download menus. IP address is 216-238-144-195, that's right. Port number A582, that's right. Uh, one for yes. Um, and this one, A0, 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 yes. So let it do the download. For the new firmware. Earlier, I was trying to reset the terminals, but it uh, it didn't work. For some reason, communications doesn't come in. Um, sometimes because the firmware is not working, so that's why. Um, this time when you update the. Um, the uh, file build, regular file build for the terminal first, then you do the firmware update. Um, but in my case, because it cannot download, so I end up have to do the firmware update first, then the regular file uh, after. So hopefully this time communication is coming in. Yes, so the firmware allow it to uh, go ahead and download now. The uh, IP address on this, on uh, on the remote um, remote download, is um, two one six dot two three eight dot one four four dot one nine five. Enter the port number is eight five eight two. Make sure to enable um, DHCP. And for the terminal ID is uh, 8080897. Okay, there's a couple of different uh, uh, TID, but uh, this one seems to be the latest that download and fix a lot of different issues. Some of the issues um, for, for the firmwares from before was um, either you cannot use the internet, um, you cannot use the chip. EMV or even there's a file error after you download a regular file so to fix that sometime I will try the different TID to update firmware but the latest one that work right now is the 97 again
I'm gonna set this up and uh, ship it out today. Okay, test the transactions, then send it to re support. One dollar. It's gonna charge two dollars seventy five cents. Let's do. Uh, yeah, let's do. Uh, one penny. Okay. Make sure the name and everything is correct. Second copy. After it's done, go ahead. Let me uh, take a look at the info on the line. Phone number 3788. This is in Texas. So their time right now is 11.23. Okay, so there's one hour earlier than this. Yep. Go ahead and close out this batch function. Check out the tip menus. Make sure the tip menu is working. Number four. Um, and this one is uh, transaction number one, $1.76. Let's skip another two pennies. Two penny, yes. So a total of one seventy eight. Got it. Close out the batch number two. Close. Okay, that's close. That's it. Now I'm gonna send this transaction to tech support at uh, seven seven zero four four one zero one nine zero to make sure the transaction is working correctly so basically that's how to fix the terminal uh, firmware okay um, it's uh, the terminal is end of life now they the file bill sometimes the app they're using on packs is oh it's not up to date killing the file killing the EMB chips um, turn up the internet and stuff like that so this is the way to fix it All right Okay, thanks guys. If you need anything, uh, this is Max with uh, direct payment services. Um, okay, thanks. Bye-bye.